back to Cuppa TV. I'm now joined by Steve Heathcock, Lawson Smith and our very own Dee Kelly to talk about the video they've put together for children in need. Hello! Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it's, it's, nice it's, like a, it's like a deja vu. Oh, we're, we're back! back. <laughs> we're back! Yeah, we're back. So, yay! Yeah, we're back. <laughs> so lovely to see you guys. Thank you. And lovely to see you, Kelly. Well. D Kelly, D. <laughs> <laughs> Do I know your name? <laughs> but it's so lovely to see you. And guys, you've been so busy. Yeah, yeah we have. So yeah. what's been going on since you were last on my sofa? Well, I mean, the Twitter's gone mad. Facebook's gone mad. I mean, we've had the video's gone on. Halloween one, it's only sat Halloween. out with that 1200 each in three days. Yeah, that's which great. Is, uh, yeah. amazing. Lot of promotion. I think they're all looking for D, though, aren't yeah, they? Yeah, Andy, you're in this yeah. video. Look at of <laughs> I don't know about looking for me, it's is just it? one of them that they can't get away from yes, me. <laughs> <laughs> you know, obviously, these guys have put together an amazing single mm. for children in need, and I've just thrown myself in yes. their video. <laughs> but I mean, it was fun. Yeah, it was super. It was, super fun. Fun. Oh, it was amazing. Really, yeah. no, I've yeah. seen the video walking home. Yes, yes, and our viewers are going to watch that. We're going to include it in a minute. It was hilarious, Steve, wasn't it? Because you know, yeah. like, obviously, I suppose I haven't really made a video kind of thing before. No, have you not, dear? Well, the no, things you've done. Have, you know, no, I think this is this is that's the that's first, yeah. Yeah. Pop, the first pop video. There we are. You see? Yes. Yeah, so, well, something see? else to embarrass the children. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. You got to sell that bit. That's another one. The bucket list. Don't see, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but it just looked a lot of fun. I have to say. But I mean, it's got a serious. It's got a serious core, isn't it? Absolutely, so of you, course. Yeah. You've done it for a serious thing, haven't you, Lawson? Oh yeah, of course. Yeah, um, I couldn't have asked for a better video, to be mm. honest. Best and where did promotion. you film it? Did you film it in Birmingham? Yeah, the Oxygen Rooms, Birmingham, mm -hmm. just Excellent. off Broad Street. Yeah. Wonderful. Pretty and good, and as far as your um, singles concerned, cause obviously this is a single that's linked. The video yeah, sorry, yeah, is course, linked yeah. to the single. So the single is going to be released on when? the sixth of November. And is uh, that yeah. called Stand Up? For the children as well, stand up for the children. Yeah. 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 So it's going to be released this week. Then. This week, so it's all exciting stuff. Yeah, so and, and, and I mean, it, how has it been? Is it? Have you been sort of on a bit of a roller coaster here? It seems to be. It seems to be going yeah. in momentum. I mean, uh, I have been sending links out saying featuring Dean Kelly and more people from the press mm -hmm. and the media are yeah. picking up on that as well. It's been a good journey. You know, think, you don't know. underestimate yourselves either, though, yeah. guys. Do you know what I mean? It's like it's an amazing song. I mean, it, it's one of them. It's so like catchy. Catchy mm. is not the word. Mm. I was, you know, it's kind of one of them. I was just singing this song <laughs> <laughs> all night. And I'm like, ah! Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yeah. It's, it's even amazing. Even it's my two-year-old singing it like oh, it's right. yeah. 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 I'm singing it in my head now, I have yeah. to say. <laughs> it is, yeah. Well, it's what, that's the, the thing about the song, because you want that, uh, you know, that beat and that mm. chorus to get in people's heads. Yes. Obviously, Lawson's yeah. got a really good message in the song as well, and yeah. with the rap, yeah. the yes. serious yeah. side of it. Yeah. So yeah. there's a bit of the serious, you got the, like the, you know, like the Agadu type with me yes. with the singing, and then you got yes. Lawson awesome with yeah, the serious side. We, we all love a bit of Agadu. We, don't we, I do. Do. <laughs> we do like it. We love Agadu, yeah. We all like to push yeah, them. I like to push them. I like to push them. I like to push them. I like I don't know what you're talking about. I don't know. Yeah, well, we do, we do. But was it oh. great for you to rap on that, though? Oh, yeah, it's, uh, I'm, like I say, I'm, I've never uh, done anything like mm. poppy like that before. Because but, uh, you are, aka, the soul keeper. That's yeah, your I'm, I'm more like name. underground, you know, like mm. a bit of the hardcore stuff. But this has been like. He's come up from underground. Yeah, yeah well, it's been a real change. You know, like, I've really enjoyed well, it. Well, I've looked at Lawson in the video as well. He's got the maracas and the glass. Uh, he's yeah. got like, different transformations. Yeah. I don't even think I could do that kind yeah, of thing, you know. He let himself go with the moment, as we all did, David, didn't we, Lawson? I mean, it took a little little bit of time though because you are like that you know that sort of you know <laughs> serious rapper yeah, yeah. 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 yeah he's got a couple of pushes to find yourself yeah you got the m m down with the kids yeah. 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 not anymore <laughs> not anymore because <laughs> <laughs> yeah. it was it was a really good rap and then it, with the with the vocals and yeah. it just it was just so energizing you just want to sing yeah. it really but we're not going to break out into song i'm definitely <laughs> not going to break out into song but i mean how has it been for you though steve because obviously you you're a musician just for people who didn't watch the show before. Just tell us well, a little bit about Well, I mean, for yourself. me, as I said last time, you know, six months ago, I had no idea of doing this mm. song, and now we're here, like, you know, like mm. press, radio, we've got D. Kelly on board. It's just like, you can't believe it, mm. really. I mean, it is just from an idea in my head, and I found Lawson, yeah. I've got this song, an idea of a song, I want to rap on it, and and it's just, you know. Now remind, it, remind, again, remind the viewers how you met, because some people might have missed that show. Yeah, so, how did the, you meet? Uh, auditions of Britain got, uh, Britain's Got Talent, mm. just standing in the queue, got talking. And, and we should have shouted the video. Touch, yeah. Yeah. Steve does like to talk, doesn't he? Oh, he does. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> he's on the phone, you can't get him off. I can talk, you know. It's kind of I feel a new career come on, talk, chat. I don't think you'd have time for any guests. Yeah. Oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> that's true, that's true. So, you met in the queue. 
and that yeah. was it really that was it yeah, yeah. Took off. It, was like a, it was like a bond like a connection even though we were like worlds apart because musical. you are completely yeah. different yeah he showed me like the other side of me basically you know mm. he brought that out in me you know giving me this project to do so I'm really mm. thankful for that like you know so I don't think I had that in me to be and honest and what about your fans what do you, what do you think your fans are going to think about this uh, I hope they just you know uh, support it and say you know because it is for charity. Yeah, yeah. Oh, of course, it's yeah. It's for a wonderful charity. Yeah. Just hope they say, like, you know, we like this yeah. stuff, but we also like this as well. Mm. Can you do more of this? Yeah. I suppose it's about when you're a musician, you've got to sort of look at different avenues as uh, well, I, don't of you? Of course, yeah. I agree, do you like yeah. it? Yeah. yeah. And what about for you, though, Dee, being involved in the video? How did that come about? <laughs> well, I was just contacted and they were sort of said, well, you know, would you mind taking part in, in the video? And I was sort of, you know, but why, you know me, it's yes. the why not, give it a go, blah, blah. But it's, it's more for what it is for. Because it it's children for children in need. need and yeah. it is, you know, and I think it's one of them, isn't it? You know, e yeah. everybody out there supports their own it's charities. Well, it's, well, it's, it's a big coup for us going, Dion. I mean, I'm a big fan. Of, as I said last time. Yes, yeah, she did, yeah. You know, when I saw you on Benefit <laughs> Street, I actually said, you know, you know some people are destined to do well. And yes. I said to my girlfriend at the time, Dee Kelly, she's going to go mm -hmm. places. I mean, Dee, you know. it's just been phenomenal. You've just completed a show here on Big Centre TV, uh -huh, of course, yeah. uh, you know, with a very serious um, tone to it. And again, that's been so well received, um, you know, from our viewers. But, so you're really exploring all avenues, really, Dee, aren't I you? There's it, more to you than meets the eye. I think that there is a lot more to me than meets the eye, and it's kind of... Um, I'm just unique, yes. <laughs> which is probably a good thing. <laughs> <laughs> you know, there's not more like me. Yeah. No, but it, it's one of them, isn't it? It's about giving something a go. If you feel passionate about something, mm. and obviously these guys, you know, they, they asked, and it, it, it's sort of, I'm more humbled that they would actually consider, you know, that mm. they'd want me to be in their video kind of yeah. thing, but... Yeah. Mm. Great. And I mean, for you, Lawson, as, as we said, you know, it's a completely different change for you. Yeah. Um, it, are you going to... Is this going to make you rap a bit differently? I wonder. Yeah, I think I think it will. Yeah, it's a bit more serious. You has know, it, has it made you sort of mm -hmm. change your views a bit by by doing something like this? Because this is very much out of your comfort zone, and for you, Steve, as well. This it is, is something really that. But I mean, really live, I'm a, I'm, a, I'm a nutter anyway yeah. on stage anyway. So I mean, <laughs> on the video, just probably. But for Lawson, yeah. yeah, he's probably a little bit out of comfort zone, but he's done a fantastic yeah, job. Yeah. It's made me think, you know, should I, should I start rapping about the actual, you know, problems at hand now yes. instead of just rapping for the sake of it, you know, yeah. because I, I can write, you know what I mean? Just yeah. You can just do a bit of both, Lawson. Yeah, it's yeah. Yeah. Do you know I mean, we've had, a, we've had a few um, rappers, you know, here on Cup of TV, and it, it's usually um, moments or life, mm. life changes or something like that that inspires them to write the rap. And I find that with rappers, is that would you say the same, Lawson? Do you kind of write about life? Yeah, yeah, mm. life at hand, you know, mm. the everyday things, mm. you know. I mean, I've so. never kind of been sort of, you know, like uh, what you'd class as like a rap fan. But I think when you actually sit down and actually listen to them, they are such personalised mm. stories, mm. aren't they? And I think that's what makes them, you know, amazing artists. Almost like a, yeah. a poem being that's, read that's to the song. Thing with yeah. the, yes. That's yeah. the thing with yeah. the rap. You can't really, you know, write for the rapper mm. because it's what's in their own head. It's, yeah. it's hard. They're all you very know. different. Yes, yeah, di very different. And, and it's wonderful to see because, Steve, you're so different, as you said. Yeah, you know, absolutely. Like and, but how wonderful that you've, you've well, got that, this connection it, it, It's now. good, like, I mean, because, I mean, I'm probably like, Lawson's probably a bit more reserved. But that's good as well because if you have two people the same mm. then uh, you might clash on ideas and stuff but because of yeah. some difference but we do we bounce off each other and we, we talk each other uh, but well we i do. talk his head off he talks, basically talk, yeah we talk <laughs> <his head> off <laughs> you, you talk no i talk to him it's a good partnership i say well you know what you know what i'm trying to do to promote the song mm. and you know have you got any yes. ideas what how we can go yeah. about doing this and what can we do different with this yeah. And I'm, tr you know, but obviously he's going to be a sort of on the on the radio and everything now as Absolutely well. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, so it's it's going to really take off. And I, I social media, really do you think will play a part in what well, you've I've done? I've this I've project? Like, you know, twelve hundred each in three days. I mean, social that, media is just yeah. massive, yeah, just, isn't it? It's yeah, yeah. Yeah. But no. you've got to keep bombarding it. Like, you know, you've got to be yes. proactive, and that's yeah. why I'm working. You know, when you're promoting it yourself, it's got you know, with only so much you can do. Yes, you know, so yeah. any views. Really, yes, absolutely. And Bally's obviously going to get on board, and I think he's got a press release yes. lined up, and he's got some yeah. other ideas yeah. lined up yeah. for, for the radio so station. Yeah. You that so, you've got further. somebody there who's supporting yeah, yeah. you. Well, Bally's been good, and obviously, yeah. we do yeah. on board as well. It's yeah, I think if you just try and do it all on your own, it's impossible. Mm -hmm. I think you need people on board, so just do it. Well, the more Bally. people involved, the better, yeah. you know. Mm -hmm. To, to, to give it momentum then, really, Absolutely for want of a better word. I think you just need it because obviously, you know, Children in Need is such a massive brand mm. and it's kind of like there's so much done. 
in the name of children in need. Yeah. And I think this is like the Midland, you know, this is the Midland yes. song for children in need. Yeah. And it's a, it is absolutely brilliant. It's so catchy. It yeah. was such fun. And, it, and, and these guys are amazing guys. Do you know what I mean? And, it's like, and they deserve to be heard. Yeah, actually, you, you've just said that it's the Midlands children in yeah. need. Yeah, yeah. 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 I think yeah. well, well to, we're all yeah. Midlands based, the, the, so. the West mm. Midlands children in need Absolutely, so. walking and, and why children in need? Why did you choose that charity? Well, I think if you remember last time, I mean, if the viewers didn't know, the March order was quite, you that know, was difficult. Right. Yeah. I was in care for a while. Mm. Uh, there was no children in need then, like, you know, and I was in with the wrong crowd, going to with the police. That's right, you spoke about you know. that, didn't you? And, and that's why I'm very yeah. passionate, yeah. I mean, uh, about, like Dee says, if you've got a passion about something, yeah. I mean, these kids... No, they deserve a chance. They deserve a chance, chance to lock, you know, I mean, of course. Right. If somebody had picked me up and said, well, Steve, you know, you ain't worthless and you've got to... That's what all these kids need, and all I think them, don't ch they? Children yeah, they need, need they as well. They've got opportunity, they? got the opportunities, have they? just want no. they need to be heard. And listen to, and I think and, children know, push, in need is very know. sort of this country based, whereas you've got yes. comic relief is for sort of you know everywhere. Right. Yes. Yes. It's about, yeah. yeah, yeah, it's about looking after. They're our future, yeah. aren't they? Money. Yeah. Challenge bigger yeah. today. I've said this last mm. time, like, and I think Dee's at the now rolling the head by yeah. saying that there as well. Yeah. Like, you know. And I mean, it is it is something that everybody knows. Children yeah. in need. Oh, yeah. I don't think there's anybody in the UK charity. that probably doesn't know about mm. children in need. Yeah. But it, it, you know, it's and it's wonderful that you've done something to, to you know to, to raise awareness yeah. Of, yeah. of that charity, along with many other people, I'm sure that are doing things around the UK, That's but right, not in the West Midlands. Oh, the West Midlands. So that we got our little keep it local, keep it real. Yes, that's it. Oh, that's a good little catch, Andy. That is keep it local, keep it real. Fantastic. Well, guys, we're going to have a look at the um, video a bit later on, but stay with okay. me, and uh, we're going to come back after the break. So the stay with us. We're going to take a short break, but come back and see me in just a minute. Welcome back to Cuppa TV. I'm still here with Dee Lawson and, and Steve, and we're just discussing children in need, charities in general. Absolutely. Um, you know, before the break, we were talking about the fact that children in need was important to you, yep. um, and we were saying how important it is in the UK. Um, you know, it, it is it is a charity that everybody knows. Why do you think people particularly like it so much, though, dear, and and are willing to do so much for children in need? I think it's basically it's it's to do with the fact that it is predominantly children. Mm. I mean, they are vulnerable. They can't. You know, it's like it's it's, it's an adult's responsibility to look after a child mm. and I think that's what it is yeah. isn't it it's kind of you know Absolutely. And, mm -hmm. and the name says it really doesn't it yes. children yeah, in yeah, need yeah. It, it, yeah. it is children in need yeah. of, of support or whatever but let's take a look at the video then and and let's see you shaking your maracas yeah, shaking my maracas and banging my tambourine so would you like to introduce the video to yeah, the stage I mean, of viewers uh, stand up for children featuring D Kelly and Lawson and Michelle yes. and release on our show on our 6th of November yeah, yeah. So money made the children smile We all need help every once in a while Now everybody bounce and we do it in style Cause every penny counts when you're feeding them out Show the world we ain't leaving them out Now play this until you hear me loud Rid the fears, wipe away those tears Wow, give them a voice and a chance for hope Stand up, clap your hands, let's go Everybody move, let the children know The help's right here and people do care, yeah Everybody move with your hands in the air And stand up for the children in need Make them feel a part of the life that you lead November 15 on the BBC Stand up for the children Stand up for the children Donate to the children Yeah, 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 yeah Stand up for the children Stand up for the children See more sad faces. Let us guide in the poorest of places. Build playgrounds, make a firm basis. Dominate, make solid foundations. Make it safe for our future generations. Give back, stand up, one nation. All together now, don't miss places. God love, God give. Stand up for the children. Stand up for the children. Donate to the children. Yeah, 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 yeah. Stand up for the children. Children, donate to the children, yeah, 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 yeah. Stand up for the 
children. Everybody stand up, put your hands up. Stand up for the children now. Clap your hands, jump up, shout out now. Stand up for the children. Show love, donate, let's go. Stand up for the children now. Let's do it for the children in need right now. Stand up for the children. Everybody stand up, put your hands up. Stand up for the children now. Clap your hands, jump up, shout out now. Stand up for the children. Show love, donate, let's go. Stand up for the children now. Let's do it for the children in need right now. Stand up for the children. Stand up for the children. Donate to the children. Yeah, 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 yeah. Stand up for the children. It's just so it's touching. It's just so catchy, isn't it? You yeah. find yourself just easily bouncy, bouncy, bouncy. bouncy. It's a bouncy one, isn't it? But, but that, isn't something it? we didn't that's, plan for. That, yeah. That's what it should be as well, isn't it? It's kind of, yeah. you know, it is. Yeah. It's, like, it's about getting it out there and... How did, was it expect? Were you expecting it to, to, you know, to turn out so well? Well, you don't know what to expect. Mm. Yeah, it's just an idea, but it's come out better than I thought, really. Yeah. But I always wanted that message, a catchy message, because the simpler the message is, the, the simple yes. songs... They are the ones that sell generally, aren't they? Like, yeah. you know? Well, the but, simple yeah. songs tend to, because people just tend to immediately pick up the lyrics yeah, yeah. and then you can start, you That's know, what I'm singing. Saying. I mean, I weren't expecting to be in it that much. Come on, no. <laughs> me and my bestie Julie, like, just kind of crushed <laughs> yes, it. It's yes. kind of... Oh, like, who else is that with you? That's oh, your best that's, friend, that's, Julie. That's one of my besties, yeah, oh. Julie. You know, it's kind of... Yeah. She was amazing as well on the day, yeah, she, was, she was happy to get involved. It's yeah. one of them where she just, you know, she comes along and she thinks she's going to just sit down and I'm like, no, 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 no. <laughs> <laughs> if I'm doing it, you're so doing it. Well, how did the video come about then? Obviously, it was your idea. So talk us through uh, how the actual well, video well, that, was that's made. That's one of Lawson's friends, isn't it? The, mm. guy, yeah, uh, the guy who does all my uh, videos, I think he does a lot of charity work mm -hmm. uh, with children and colleges and stuff uh, so he actually did the video for free as mm. you know because uh, I usually pay for more videos donated his services so he really donated yeah. his services you know so he wanted to get involved mm. I charged so him a fortune yeah. <laughs> <laughs> It's yeah. a fortune of biscuits, yeah. you know. Yeah, fortune of biscuits. I, don't even, yeah. I, got, I never even got a biscuit. She didn't? No. Oh, oh you'll have a biscuit get, here. Have a biscuit here. Have a biscuit here. That's why I'm wasting away. <laughs> <laughs> so, what do you think, guys, about charities in general? Because, you know, there's been a lot in the press um, over <laughs> recent months about people not giving to charities, charity shops are closing down, people sure. are not donating goods to charities. What's your do take you know, on that? I think today? my take is it's not that they don't want to. I think there's an awful lot of pressure being put on people nowadays mm. it's like you know if you go walking through town you get stopped every sort of couple of minutes by loads of different charities you're at home they're constantly knocking on your doors it's kind of you know gone is the time when someone could have a charity in mind you don't see like collection boxes anymore they're actually coming to you instead of people going to them Absolutely. and I think there is an awful lot yeah. of pressure because people do want to give to charities but they should be able to give off their own free Will they don't and want not to be have it told. No, or guided, and there, there is a lot of vulnerable people out there who would feel sort of intimidated by two, you know, opening their front door to two people who are not going to move away from that mm. door until you've given them bank details and signed forms. Yeah. And it's scary. Yeah, that it to me, yeah. that's what I'm saying. Yeah. It is forced. Mm. That to yeah. me is not charity. It's like, you know, I mean, I donate to a certain amount of charities and. For now, I'm not going to change them because, you know, their choice, you know, they, they, we've decided to donate to them as a family. But it's like the pressure they put on you. Now, I'm kind of strong-willed, mm. but even then, they, they will not move from that door. Mm. But I think, you know, if the people were just left to sort of, you know, how it used to be. I yeah. think Dave's got a really valid yeah, point there. Like, what do you think? What's I think, well, uh, Dave was thinking basically what I wanted to say anyway, because it's true. I mean, you walk down the high street and mm. you're on bond body with these people. Mm. And so then these, people knocking on your doors. The change tubs and stuff, they've all gone now from most like mm. bars and stuff. You don't see that anymore. Like, That's what I'm saying. Free, it's all free bank like, details. Yeah. We want, And That's people it. are very wary about yeah. handing over bank details. It's as simple as. Yeah. But, you know, and I think, you know, it's kind of, and it is a shame with regards to charity shops because there used to be so many of them around. Mm. 
but people are sort of using charity shops now as a place to get rid of all their broken stuff or their rubbish stuff yeah. and well, charity also. shops now have to pay to have all that stuff taken away yeah. and it's kind of they're not getting half of half through what they used to yeah, it's sort of shops are closed yeah. now, you know yes, yeah, I'm walking yeah, up yeah, yeah. I mean are, it's, yeah. what do you think Wilson about that is yeah I think yeah. Uh, these the nail on the head like you know mm. uh, don't think there's any much more you could really say on mm. that on that subject. Mm. Mm. But it, it, it is, but it is important for the charities course, yeah. that they have, you know, they they, they have regular Definitely. income and you know they donate to the shops. But how could we change that sort of view then that seems to have you that I seems to have, have fallen on us here in the UK? I think society has changed so much, hasn't it? It's oh, like yeah. you know you get them bags through the door now where they say leave your clothes outside and they'll be mm. collected. Yeah. Them bags aren't being collected because they're being ripped open and gone through, and but you know yeah. it's, it's kind like these, of uh, you know, the clothes for cash and all that. Yeah, people would rather do that now than get their money, try and get as much money back as they can, rather than give it to the charities now. Mm. But they I don't think you know we we now. do still need you know the good old charity shop and you know it, it's it's I think it's still in people, but people have just lost heart. Mm. I think yeah. because there's With so many um, you know things going on in the world as well oh. as the UK where charities do a lot of good for the people that are in need children in need for Absolutely. instance yeah. is, a, is a clear example of that so how do we then sort of get find this balance do you think where oh. people will donate I think we but maybe go back to old-fashioned values as maybe they was fine because I think uh, the start has changed so much mm. and it's yeah. gone like the other way and it's we you know when like in the olden days you could leave your door open that type of stuff you know more yeah. family orientated and stuff like that like and it's, it's out the, that's out the window yeah. and stuff like that now i think you still need it but it's like sort of back off with the pressure kind of thing a bit it's like i mean we've still got you know at home like from when mum our kids have got their their two you know the guide dogs pots and they put all their change in the guide dog pots and that's like not with them being pressured that's mm. what they've always done and I think, you know, that kind of works well. Yeah. But I think there's so many charities out there and they're all, they're all so deserving. It's not that they're not deserving kind of thing. Yeah, it's like the kind of sport for choice. Shall I give yes. to this yeah. one yeah. now because of this? Yeah. Shall I give to that one now because of this? No. Yeah. I think um, children's charities always seem to do very well in the UK. Uh, why do you think that is? I think in the UK, uh, children, that people just love children. Like mm. in the UK, it's a big thing, you know, mm. uh, like you say. And I think it's one of them, isn't it? It's like, you know, it's like, you know, as an adult, you decide to bring a child into the world. And it's kind of, you know, circumstances okay with certain people, you know, it might not work out. Children are born with disabilities, children are born into situations, they end up in, you know, in care of local authority. And that's not their mm. fault. We yeah. should, you know, we should be there, we should be looking out for them, we should be helping for them. And it's like, I'm sorry, you know, if you watch an advert for a child's charity, if you don't feel that pang in your heart, then you're some a very hard yeah, human being, aren't you? It's kind yeah. of. Yeah. 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 But that's not obviously not taking anything away from all the other charities no. that are out there. Mm -hmm. It's one of them, isn't it? Whereas a human being, mm. if you could support them all, it'd just be absolutely amazing, yeah. wouldn't it? But you know, if only you could. Yes, I, th I think of all the charities, the children's charities are the forefront of, of the charity. They can't really help themselves, yes. can they, Lawson? And like you were saying, Steve, the reason why you so want like to So I was in care that myself, you like, you know, somebody in there. Care. But so, you know, I try and, in some respects, I want to be a voice for these kids. Mm. I, know, not, I don't want to, you know, get away with this, but, you know, if I can get a message and make a difference to one kid, mm -hmm. then... Mm. No, to me, yeah, that's doing a good job. Stand up and say, well, you know, stand up for the children. Stand up for the children. Oh, oh, that's a good name for a song. Mm. <laughs> 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 yeah. Oh, if the one child says, stands up and says, actually, I can do this, I can go to college, mm. I can go to that's university. That's what I'm saying, you know, them just kids you saying know, that you work. Anything's you know. possible. I Every mean, child deserves, yeah, kid a deserves a chance. chance. We've yeah. got, I mean, we've had uh, quite a number of guests on, on the show talking about mental health, um, and mental health in children in particular, where the suicide rate in their young in the UK, yeah. particularly males, um, is on the increase. Um, do you think, you know, society has just become, like you said, you would like to get back to old fashioned values? Do you think we society's moved on so quickly? Well, it's a lot of people, so ma magazines, you've got to look at the girls, like they've got to look a certain mm -hmm. size, size zero, and all this type of stuff, and you know, the way they dress and that. And I think even for young lads, you know, with muscle fitness and all that, yeah, and the way they dress. Different worlds, yeah. yeah, it's a different world now. I just kind of don't think, you know, in a way, I don't think children are listened to as much as they should be. And that's mm. why I think, you know, it's really good that they are starting to introduce, you know, discussing mental health issues mm. or sexual, you know, orientation issues mm. into schools. 
because I think, you know, it's them teenage years, isn't it, when they hit secondary school, okay. that I think, you know, that their life pressures do change, exam yeah, pressure, I'd, I'd peer pressure, and everything, mm. and I think, you know, it is good, but I think mm. we do, you know, we do maybe need to, as much as they do our heads in, you know, <laughs> yes. listen, yeah. to, to, them. listen to them a little bit more, yeah. yeah. I don't think the schools teach, like, kind of thing, where that, whereas they should, you know, they're still mm. teaching mm. all those like mathematics, English, they don't teach, like, mental fractions. health and stuff, and until they get, like, into yeah. university, so if they started it from a young age. They'd already be suffering with depression yeah. and this, that, mm. and the other, and that's where it's all. And why do you think it is on the increase? I mean, why do you think a charity like Children in Need that you're, you know, so very kindly donating the proceeds of, the, of your sales, of the records yeah. too, why do you think we even need something like that? I think because... And it's become even more so I in think the it's last because children years. aren't listened to. It's like they're not provided enough So it goes for. back to what you were saying. I, I really yeah. do. It's yeah. kind of, you know, I think it's like you say, you know, young fellow like yourself, you know, it, it, it's about providing the support for these people, who, for these kids who want to be musicians, who That's want it. to be rappers, who want to be artists. It's yeah, kind of, you know. There ain't, there ain't really a place I can go and just say, you know, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to do that, you know. Yeah, there's no youth clubs Nothing anymore, there's no that, holiday yeah. clubs. <laughs> yeah, and I think Children in Need does specifically provide, you know, you know, financial support towards centres and activities. So you're giving back to the community. That's what we're working on. Yeah, and that's how it should be. Because we don't street corners. I mean, that's something going to get in, you know, disillusioned with life and get in trouble with drugs or whatever. And that's the culture today, you know. But it's a lot of it. So how do you see your future, guys? What are you up to in the next few months or so? Next few months, I've got an album coming out in December, maybe early January. Uh, it's an underground album. Mm -hmm. uh, I've got a couple of more videos coming out. Um, I've got some radio right. interviews lined up. Wonderful. Uh, so things so looking are, are looking yeah, good for, for you. Me, yeah. And for you, Steve? Well, uh, the doors are open. I might maybe go down the line of D or something. I'd try different avenues, anything. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I mean, obviously, I'm going to keep. I want to. We were on about writing another single to follow yeah. this one up. Because yes. obviously, I just want to do one single yeah. and then do nothing. Think. Maybe get D on board again. See you know. <laughs> 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 TV. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Don't say yes or no. Yeah. You'll commit yeah. yourself. I'll have to get them on one day. Oh, yeah. <laughs> and do you keep him busy? Well, you know me, Monica, as always, I will just go with, with the, the flow. flow. <laughs> well, it's just, uh, you know, it's been great to have you back on the show. Thank you so much for coming. Pleasure, and, pleasure, Monica. You know, I am so wish that the video is going to be successful Fingers and crossed, the, crossed, the crossed, singles. Crossed, so crossed, remind us of the yeah. single release date again. 6th November. Six November. November. Yeah. Stand Wonderful. up for the children. Yeah. Stand up for the children. Yeah. Excellent. Well, we're going to hear that video again. So that's it for today's show. I'd like to thank all my guests for joining me today. And if you'd like to get in touch with us, you can do so A Big Centre TV. We'd love to hear from you. Now to play us out, we're going to see the video again. So introduce it again, guys. Awesome. 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 Yeah, it's uh, Soul Division, Stand Up for the Children, and it's a track for Featuring children. Featuring me. Yeah. 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 Take care. Bye-bye. <laughs> <laughs> So money make the children smile We all need help every once in a while Now everybody bounce and we do it in style Cause every penny counts when you're feeding them out Show the world we ain't leaving them out Now play this until you hear me loud Rip the fears, wipe away those tears Why? Give them a voice and a chance for hope Stand up, clap your hands, let's go Everybody move, let the children know The help's right here and people do care, yeah Everybody move with your hands in the air And stand up for the children in need Make them feel a part of the life that you lead November 15 on the BBC Stand up for the children
children. Everybody stand up, put your hands up. Stand up for the children now. Clap your hands, jump up, shout out now. Stand up for the children. Show love, donate, let's go. Stand up for the children now. Let's do it for the children in need right now. Stand up for the children. Everybody stand up, put your hands up. Stand up for the children now. Clap your hands, jump up, shout out now. Stand up for the children. Show love, donate, let's go. Stand up for the children. Now. Let's do it for the children in need right now. Stand up for the children. Stand up for the children. Donate to the children. Yeah, 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 yeah. Stand up for the children. Stand up for the children. Children, don't 